We come on the air this Monday with breaking news. Dive crews working to pull a car out of the Missouri River. They believe it went into the river last night. 41 Action News reporter Ariel Rothfeld is along the river where crews are working right now. What do we know about the car so far, Ariel? Well, Chris said they believe the car matches the description witnesses gave police last night, but right now it is just a waiting game. Take a look. You can see the dive team still in the water. Right now they're consulting with the tow truck how to get that vehicle out of the water. And as I just mentioned, they do believe it is a white sedan, which again matches the description witnesses gave police last night. And we've been here all day as dive teams have been searching the river. And I can tell you this search was no easy feat. Not only did the river's current pose as a challenge, but the car floated down the river far from where witnesses saw it go into the river. Now to locate it, the Missouri State Highway Patrol used sonar devices and chains to narrow in on one specific area, which took most of the day before they could search with divers. It traveled quite a bit. They are buoyant for a while. You can imagine what kind of air is in a vehicle, you know, when it goes into the water. So it's going to float for a little while and then it'll uh, go straight to the bottom. Now again, the tow truck here should be removing that car from the river any minute. Now there is a growing crowd among the embankment here, just watching to see what will happen. Once the car is towed, we'll to we're told KCPD will look at the car, find out who owns it and what the situation was, which drove it into this river here last night. We are live in Kansas City, Ariel Rothfield, the Now KC. Hey, Ariel, I know that we haven't heard that there was a driver. Any reason to believe someone was in the car at the time? Yeah, Krista, we don't know. Witnesses said they didn't see a driver screaming for help last night. They didn't see a driver swimming to shore. That's why they are giving us this big distance here, just in case there is a body inside of that car. They want to be respectful and move everybody away. So they don't know, and they won't know until they move that right. car out of the river completely. Right. Obviously learning a lot more when it comes out. Ariel, thanks for the follow-up, and we'll be checking back with you throughout the uh, afternoon. Thanks.